up everybody welcome to gaming on board my name is Josh tonight we're going to take a look at a collectible card game um, but don't stop the video just yet uh, well you might after I show you what it is but it's not Yu-Gi-Oh it's not Pokemon it's not Magic the Gathering it's none of that it's something brand new and it's designed by Eric Lang and Kevin Wilson what Eric Lang and Kevin Wilson making a CCG well it's Munchkin the collectible card game so let's go down the table and see what you get in one of these uh, dueling starter packs. This is everything you need for a two-player game. Let's go check it out. There it is. Now, if you hate Munchkin, you probably already stopped this video by now. I'm kind of meh on Munchkin. I mean, I like it. I have uh, Munchkin Zombies Deluxe, um, but it's I mean it's okay. It's a fun little game. Especially if you've got a big group of people and you really don't care what's going on. Um, so, I picked up the Wizard and Bard uh, starter pack, and it comes with a 12-card booster pack. Yep, it is a collectible card game. So, uh, there you go, new player start with a starter set. Guess what? Guess what, guys? Everybody's a new player. Nobody's played this. We don't, nobody knows what this is. Well, anyway, 20 bucks for a starter pack. Wild Potent Weapons, Cast Flashy Spells, Cheat with Impunity. That's right, there's a huge bluffing uh, part to this game. So anyway, we won't be keeping this box anyway, but I figured I'd show you what it looks like. Let's see what we get in the Wizard and Bard. Yep, that's it. Alright, so, got the rule book. Oh, the rule pamphlet, anyway. Set up, play in the game, interrupts, ending the game, anatomy of a card, game area, that's cool. Glossary, keywords, that is a lot of text. Face the monster, run away, check for cheating. Okay, come on Eric Lang, don't let me down. So, that's cool. Um, and then you've got a list of all the cards in all the starter decks. So we got the Wizard and the Bard. And then there's two more starter decks that you can buy. Two more starter packs. Sorry. So this is, I'm guessing, gold. Because I know some of these cards cost gold. And then there's two runaway tokens and a black die. I'm going to bust this open. Yeah, run away, limp away. So you can run away the first time. <clears throat> but if you've already run away and you limp away, I think you take like two damage. If you run away again after you've already done it. And this has to be gold. Yeah. Not sure why they did the gradient, the blue to yellow gradient. And then just a plain old little black and white die. There you go. And then we got these things. These are level level counters. Because just in, like in Munchkin you can level up. And there's certain, like uh, I call them enchantment cards or allies or something like that that you can only play if you're a certain level. So... You will be leveling up, and I think you can win by getting to level 10 or killing the other player. Each person has 20 health. So you get two of those. I'll open this booster pack last. And here's these. These are the two starter decks. I believe they're 30 cards each. So each player will have a hero. Here's the Orc Bard. You can tell it's the hero because it says hero and it's got 20 life. Look, a little meeple. <clears throat> Use when a card is moved face down to your stash. Zap, okay? That's their version of tap. So you zap it and unzap it. So, <laughs> I like that, period. Uh, being a magic player. And then, since we are a bard, we have a bard hero, we get to play bard 
cards in our deck. And I think that's denoted by this little music symbol here. So we've got 99 bottles. Mischief. Mischief. There's an ally. So you see the gold cost up here and the life down here. Let's see if I can find. <clears throat> there we go. Danger zone. So locate. There are locations that uh, change certain or cause certain things to happen, but you can only have one location out at a time. Here we go. Here's some loot cards. See, this would require me to be level three. See that star there? So I'd have to be at level three to even play this card. All right. And then we've got 3,872 orcs. So I don't know what that means. I wish I did, but I don't. It has three life and it's five uh, gold to actually get it to fire. Card shark, chainsaw, bloody dismemberment, drop bear, 11 foot pole. Hey, look, the gazebo. Hammer time. Dun, 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 dun. Hey, look, a land. And it's an island. And a mountain. And a swamp. And a forest. And a plain. <laughs> I see what you did there. Another, uh, MTG reference. Vanilla Mental. Get it? Like elemental? Anyway. Walking Dreads. Okay. So that's the Bard deck. Here's the Wizard deck. Here's the Wizard Hero. Zap this to reduce the gold cost of the next mist if you play by one. And I'm guessing that's the little wizard symbol. So I bet you these are all wizard cards. There we go. Bezel Bob. Blood Geyser. Crash and Burn. I could have sworn it was like a purple lotus in here. I saw a purple lotus somewhere. Oh look, he's got 3,872 orcs also. Okay, a bunch of these cards are the same. Yeah, Gazebo, Hammer Time. Yeah, these are all the same. Wow, okay. So you've got hero specific cards and then all the same cards, so I guess that makes it even. Let's see what we got in our booster pack. This is a 12 card booster. I have no idea how much the boosters are. Or how, I guess these are rare. The rares in the back. There's an R there. There's a C there. There's a U there. So we got three uncommons. A rare. And what, eight commons? Yeah. There you go. So our commons are, can't touch this. I wonder if this goes with hammer time. I'm sorry, I've got to check real quick. Alright. One damage from your hero at target stash monster. Encore, after this resolve, stash it instead of discarding. Huh, I guess not. That'd be cool if they made them work together. Um, Muggy Sap. Skewer. Another chainsaw. Woodland Workout. Some more dreads. Dr. Meow Practice. That's funny. Spin Kick. Silent but Deadly. Spiky Bit. Colors of Cloning and Bling Beastie. You may squish a target loot that you control. Squish means discard. If you do, this gains two whatever. I'm not sure what that means. Sorry, I just don't know. So that's everything you get in the box if you buy one of these starter packs. You'll get two 30 card decks um, and a booster pack. All these tokens, the die. We'll see how it plays. I don't know. I'm kind of done with CCGs, honestly. I was into Magic for a long, long time, and I just, I'm done. <laughs> but I had to check this out, because, I mean, it's Munchkin, and uh, Eric Lang was involved, Kevin Wilson was involved, so it's got to be half decent. But anyways, hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, leave in the comments your thoughts on Munchkin, good or bad. I want to hear it all. Um, what's your favorite CCG? Have you ever been really into any CCGs? Um, also hit that like and subscribe button. We do post 
probably about twice a week on YouTube. We also post on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter almost every day. So be sure to check us out on all those social media at Gaming On Board. And as always, thank you for watching and play all the games.